Hello, I am called Lee NYA. This is the second um, video on um, update on the six point uh, six point uh, four no wa Adazienu Akweze road construction ongoing road construction by the Soludo led government of Anambra State. Um, this is the um, second uh, uh, video for that. This stretch of road, 6.4-kilometer uh, uh, road under construction. Sorry about the shaking of the video because the, um, our man down there is uh, on the, um, Okada on the bike. That's why the, um, that's uh, a, a bit of uh, um, shaking. So that's, um, you can see that uh, work has so much, uh, and some areas, um, the drainage has not been completed, but you can see that 95% of the drainage has been done. And there are a lot of culverts and, um, you know, there was, uh, some months ago, there was an um, issue with uh, some people doing culverts in some area of this road that was, uh, um, you know, there was a complaint that we brought here and there, that has been ratified. Um, so that's, uh, you can see that this uh, drainage, this one has not been completed. They are still doing concrete on the floor. They are still flooring on it. So, but uh, it's just 5% of the drainage left. They have done 95%, both sides of the road almost. So, um, that's why we are bringing you this. I am called the NYE, the son of wonderful. Um, remember to always subscribe. Um, Remember to like, comment, uh, share our videos, and subscribe if you have not subscribed. Uh, you can see here also the, um, the drainage has not been completed. But they are working day in and day out to see that they complete this road before the rain set up. We hope that um, they will complete it so that the governor will come to um, commission this road. This road is very important to this uh, uh, town, the, these towns that are on this uh, area. And it will also open up business opportunities because there are quite uh, some sizable enterprises that are establishing in this area. But because of the poor road network, it has not been easy for anybody. So the flooding and the erosions and all those things so this has been a major problem. So you can see here they level they recently level this place. You can see they um I think uh, two three days ago they level this place. They are still working on it. You see, so meaning that they might meet the target of finishing this road before the rain. Within a month, this road might be completed or depending. Uh, hopefully we are finger crossed that uh, this will be completed this is the second um, video for this uh, if you have watched the first one this is the second one so um that's how it is anambra has been uh, a consortium uh, a consortium site everywhere there's so much construction and we have not seen this thing for a long, long time. So hopefully that um, they will uh, continue on that trajectory um, and continue with a timeline because all these things uh, is good to uh, have a way of completing them uh, fast enough. Um, so, and uh, doing it uh, in a very, very, uh, um, you know, with quality materials and standard rules. 
Although we can also see there's improvement in the road construction in Anambra State, unlike what we used to have in the past. I think now they are using stone base. Um, so I, I do believe that they will continue to improve. I think this place, they have not done the drainage. You can see they have not done drainage on this area. They have not done the drainage. They have not... Uh, so that's uh, part of the 5% that is left to be done. So hopefully um, the contractor will um, continue, you know, um, at least getting more uh, manpower or workers to, uh, in order to complete the job. And I don't know if uh, he's mobilized very well because some of these problems can be uh, issue of funds why they take it uh, you know uh, not too fast but according to what uh, the government of anambra state normally say that they normally mobilize the contractors but we don't actually know because we don't know the contract they entered into we don't know if they have been uh, fully mobilized or fully um you know you know the um the work done being paid for i don't know but let's just hope that uh uh this area part of the rural area of anambra state will uh, have a sigh of uh relief and know that the government also care for them it's uh, it's um wonderful in anambra state that the rural areas are not left out in uh, road construction uh, but uh, some people will say, okay, let's focus more in some of these key uh, urban areas and, and round them up. Yes, it's very, very important to get them because they will generate the money to do other places. But we can also be doing two of them together by, you know, getting the forms available. Sorry about that. Um, it's also good to be uh getting the forms the the loan to do all those jobs because um by getting them it will be able to because those roads will create the economy that will help the government to pay off the loan if there is no money for that because the economy will suddenly expand and once it expands the state will make more money and be able to do more projects for the citizenry so thank you very much for joining us. I am still Cordially NYA, the son of Wonderful. I will see you in the next uh, video. Remember to subscribe. Remember to share. Thank you. Remember what we brought to you is the 6.4 kilometer Nokwa Adazienu Akweze Road by the Anambra State Government under Soludo. Thank you. See you in the next one. Bye.